ISVS for Dr. Bass. He's purchasing my two BMS boards. Doc, I just uh, wired them up for you so that when you get them, you can uh, just hook them up. Now, I was just telling you earlier, there's a problem with one of the boards where the light wasn't, or you probably read up on it on the forums, but one of the lights wasn't turning uh, orange, which is this board here, which is I'm using it as a slave board. The problem is in the, is in the main channel now. I don't know where it is, but regardless, I'm gonna say that you don't need it. So I didn't really. I tried fixing it. I couldn't figure it out, and then I'm just like, let me just configure it for 40 series because that's where you're gonna use be using it for anyways. So um, yeah, here it is. I just removed all the balancing leads. I highly recommend, especially for an EV car, to uh, permanently solder the balancing leads. It'll avoid any problems occurring in the BMS if you do that. So I've removed them all. I've done the hardness for you for the, the leads to slave the boards. And this wire here goes from the 24 series point all the way to the first channel, which or you can put it right there on the little dot, the first dot. And then you, know, you run your wires as regularly uh, you do. So uh, yeah, I hope you're okay with the fact that I didn't fix that channel. Let me know. All these channels are pretty much dead for you. I don't know what you can do with them, but anyways, you can't use them. Um, I'll just show I'll show you it working. If I can find my screwdriver, which I don't know where it is. Oh wait, I have it. I have it. There it is. Here you go. I'm using a lot of battery. Look at that. Two power supply and an extra 40 volts because it has to peak out at 150. So here it is. So this is as low as I, as I can put the power supply. Obviously, if it was lower, it would shut off. There it is. The green light means go. And that's pretty much everything for that. Uh, yeah, hope you enjoy it. Thanks. Bye-bye.